again hello and welcome to dreams and meanings and welcome to a OOO Dorian OOO showcase so I've already <laughs> I already recorded this once and um, I realized I had my camera mic on in the background I was gonna do the commentary on it after and uh, edit it that way and um, yeah so all my footage became unusable because I had the uh, background um, sound um, on my recorded footage from a camera which I didn't realize the mic was turned on so I'm going to do a live stream and play it that way it's just easier and um, it, it's just easier really and I'm starting to um, prefer to live stream things rather than edit it because really you don't don't edit that much anyway you kind of um just waste a bit of time so yeah it's just easy to live stream so this is what i'm doing so uh, okay you said you've probably heard of um dorian already um if you haven't then you're missing out he's um made a lot of great creations a lot of uh, great games his style I've done a showcase on Dirty Harold's his style of games pretty similar to Dirty Harold's quite short and fun and they've all got that um, just that one more go factor you know um, so you just you know you just want another go try and beat your score or um, whatever so um, what we're going to do is going to play all his games and we're going to start from the start you can see he does a lot of other stuff as well so um we use some of the assets um his assets used for some of his games is that No idea. Okay, yeah. Okay, here we go. We start with this one. This one is hungry, hungry. Um, but um, po pomos. <laughs> I don't know if I'm saying that right. It looks like something from a meme. I'm probably missing out and uh, <laughs> saying it wrong. But anyway, um, I think this is a multiplayer game, so it's. Well, it can be a multiplayer game, but you can also play it against a computer. Pomeranian. So, um, yeah, really. Pomeranian. Ready. Okay. And he's just kind of got a. And this is many of these, um, what would it be? What would it be? The cold I don't know. Looks like I'm gonna win. Hell yeah. Yes, yeah, so it's a multiplayer game as well, so you can play against friends if you want to. I won. Okay. <laughs> so, um, that's that. Let's move, let's move on swiftly. And, um, okay, this one kind of, um, Um, by Danny Lostickman, a new model by Danny Lostickman, Sound Browser Creations, uh, Dash Daniel Stickman Supercharge. It. This is, if you've not read the title, it's a, um, it's a Dorian showcase. So I'm going to be playing Dorian um, games in this stream. Join my stream on Wednesday and, um, and recommend some of your games then. Right, so um, here we go. This is cross confusion. Um, you got to get these dots to the red line, and and um, yeah, each button that, uh, triggers a different um, nice little intro. 
yeah each button could, as you can see look um, each button the controls a different cube in a different way so you've got to work out what you've got to press we've got the um, the motion controls as well so I'm trying to jiggle everything about that one just moved a bit then although they press not wrong way here we go here we go very no stuff stuff there we go with that one what else have we got left turn pad touch pad pushing the buttons there we go triangle there circle for that one okay we've got two more left trying to work it out this is okay this is poor but what we got that's that was L, um, L2 got one more oh oh I guess it's moved and I don't know what I pushed. What? Literally. Oh, we yeah. have D-pad. Yay! We got there in the end. Um, Porky Pick, hello. Thanks to um, you see my video. No problem. It looks fantastic, by the way. The stuff, the um, the, um, the mini map you're working on looks really good. And I presume that is that uh, that video with the mini map on it. Is that a project you're working on? Right. So that's Cross Confusion by Dorian. As you can see, I've already played all these because this, this is, like I said, this is the first time I've recorded it and. Um, and they messed up the recording basically right so this is a coin game it's something about these coin games I love I just I don't know what it is maybe it just reminds you of the good old days I say good old days, it's still, still playing now when you get to the arcade, it's kind of a must thing you have to do. Like you never win anything. Like, and have you ever <laughs> gone up to, um, you need like you change your money to like say two pences or, um, or whatever the uh, equivalent is in America, maybe um I'm trying to think what would it be like a nickel or something like that oh, anyway um well, I caught be like probably quarters in America um and you never like when you win say a load of them sort like you never take them back up and cash them back in or you never take the money home you always keep putting them in until you lose all your money But um, yeah, get the idea. This is coin pusher game. What is that? It's a two p two p yeah, two p machine. Um, yeah, that's a nice, nice little game. Uh, I don't know if I'm saying your name right. Por Porky Porky Pick Porky Pick. Yeah, I love coin machines. I mean, who doesn't? Everyone must love um, love um, coin machines. MM Logic and in puzzle. Okay, I think I struggled to do th this one on on. I couldn't. All right, so um, jumble them up. I 
sure I'll get the pieces in. Resize. What? Okay. But I kind of I do like doing puzzles in real life, but I, I hate doing them on computers. It always seems a bit awkward. Right, so you get the idea, it's a puzzle game. But yeah, very cool. Porky pick, yep, yeah, that's good. <laughs> Thank you. To every props, I think. Yeah, um, like I said, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of that game, but you know it's a nice little game, and these are these are some of um, uh, Dorian's earlier games. This is uh, this is a pool game by Dorian. You can literally do anything you want, right? So you just <laughs> kind of control, so you can do stuff like um, the go over here. Maybe go a bit lower. Oh, no, no. I'm sure I could hit the balls. Then let me turn it around. Right. <laughs> Just carry on it. You can, yeah, this kind of dev. Here you go, look, that's it. We're hitting the balls. Look, I'm not one for table. This is a pool game simulator. Good old classic games. You play this a lot when you used to go out to the pubs. I said, don't do that as much anymore. Um. You are productive. Um, what's it? Porky pick. Cheetah. <laughs> Cheetah. Um, I've been called that before actually. What was. I was accused of it on. Um, oh, Dirty Owls accused me of it on, on, on. When I did a playthrough with one. Oh, actually, I do, I do a series on, on. Oh, stuff in the thing. I do a series of uh, on Dirty Owls, which is beating Dirty Owls his own game and I found um, a shortcut in one of his games and I thought I beat the score and got I think second on the leaderboard and um, yeah he, he wasn't very happy with that he called me a cheater but you know hey hey if you want to near finish my latest app animation hey if you want to near finish my latest animation I don't don't get that what the well right, um yeah so that's a remix of pool 2019 by Dorian I don't know if it's a remix of um Another one of his games, I don't know. Right, timer and scoreboard demonstration. Right, this is 
balls and holes okay so this is another um, another simple game which you get these little games um, when you was kids and you get like um, a little case and you have to try and roll the balls into like little little divots that's kind of what you've got to do here but um, yeah so at this point still some of um, that yeah, um, that yeah, some of Dorian's earlier games um, trip trip to the desert if you if you want to watch it sort of English <laughs> laugh out loud um, you, you want me to watch something of yours is that what you're trying to say um i can't on this this is just a uh a dorian um showcase as if as if you were trying to if, if, if that is what you're trying to say but yeah um definitely play some um any recommendations i play like in the evening midweek stream or um, mainly on Saturdays I can't get this on there oh sorry then with no don't worry it's cool um, but I've also you can always um, yeah you've come to one of my streams on the Wednesday on the Saturday or um and ask ask me to play some stuff or you can um uh, a discord where you can i've got a channel on the discord where you can uh, recommend games i can play on my stream i kind of add them to a to a playlist for when i do my stream right so this is balls and holes Whoa, didn't mean to tilt it that much. I think I need to reset my controller. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna, I better do that now. Got one more to go in. One more to go in. No, 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 no. Go, go. No, no, go back this way, back this way, back this way. Yeah, it's going to be some sort of uh, record. yeah uh, yeah like i said i've got discord so um if you want to come to my discord i will le uh, usually leave um, a link in my description it won't be in my description at the moment but it'd be if you it'd be on one of my earlier videos if you want to check it out or um, after i finish uploading i'll usually add the the links then that's if you do discord Um, okay, Balls and Owls. That's Balls and Owls by Dorian. Uh, good game, I don't know if I played a good game then. Alright, um, showcase. Next is our oh, Fruity Machine. So, this is exactly what it what it says it's a fruit fruit machine so you can um i think you can nudge and hold as well i think this is when Dorian start to get more into logic of, of um of his games Let's see if i can win anything Want to win something? Am I going to win anything? Doesn't look like it. Give me 
Right, this is a optical illusion, which is kind of a It's probably the only one I've seen on on um, on dreams. Right, so you take the lines, you see all they're all brown, or like um, yeah, like a brownish, pinky, skinny color. You move the lines, and you add the lines again, they look different colours. Crazy, huh? Right, now this is... Well, this is the first game I really fell in love with, of Dorian's. And this is Tumbling Dice, which by the way, let's check, I'm still top of the leaderboard. Look at that, guys. <laughs> which is, it's, it's, uh, uh, this game is actually part of our community challenge at the moment. We have community challenges on, on, the, um, on the, uh, uh, the Discord, on the Dreams I Mean is Discord. And um, this is the game that's on there at the moment, which, um, yeah, you can kind of compete against each other. On, um, on one of my channels in my discord which is cool I'm I'm leading at the moment so yeah and that this game is quite um, I don't know you need a bit of luck but it's also quite rewarding when, when uh, you do pull off some good rolls so you can see the times so it's obviously the further down the the board you get, the um, more the times you get. So I've rolled a four on times three, so you get twelve. And it's as simple as that. And you, let's try it. Get it over. Nope. Three, but. I'm, I don't know. Let's do a hard roll, try and knock that one. <laughs> knocked it further up, but I still got a one, but just in the, in the um, times five zone. And you get four dice, and see if we can do pull off something. Nope, okay, dice off the table. So as simple as that, you have four dice, roll it down the table, and you have to you have to score of your four dice together to give you a total score, which is, on this case is 28. Very nice, um, fun game. It's definitely one which I just wanted to keep on playing. Um, we just have a quick look at this. This is when the bottle bottle cap challenge was um, it was big, and it. Everybody seemed to be doing it. Um, okay, so. Hear my crew saying they think I'm too old, but I still got it. Damn. How I challenge you to do that, Crooked Army. Thanks for the challenge, Roger Whitebeard. As you can see, I'm more than capable. Damn. <laughs> Which is cool. Go through different characters. And, uh... Actually, I haven't thumbed up that. I should give that a thumb up. Right. So, in some of Dorian games, he likes to do random things. I'll put... 
I'll put that across right, but like um, they spot the difference every time um, you play and you spot the difference. Differences are randomized, so they're all it's different every single time. Which, yeah. So, and now it's just randomizing everything up. And now I've got to try and find. Back to this side. The thing I didn't like is that it's ref it's reflected. I can do that one. Something down here and there. I'll do this side. Am I pushing the wrong one? Oh, go! It's pushing the wrong button. Right. Do this side then. Right, um, let's find these differences. Is there one on the ice? Uh, okay, okay, that one's missing. Um, can't see anymore. One, two, three, four, five, five bars. That's normal. Um, okay, oh, okay, there's loads. Missed all those, but there you go. Yes, yeah, spot the difference again. Technically, that is pretty damn good, especially with the like it picks 10 different um, differences and randomizes them, which is damn good. Okay, and Dolby uh, title screen, if you see that enough. Um, where are we now? Oh, flippable drop, okay. I'm not good at this one at all. You need um, like reflexes of a cat on this. Right, so you drop the ball and you can see the colour of the flippers, you have to push the right button to to move the flipper out of the way. So there's a green flipper there, you push triangle to move the green flipper out of the way. And blue, push X, and pink, square, and um, red, circle. So it's just as simple as that. So drop the ball, push in triangle, and the thing is, the uh, fa fashy stuff going down, the quicker you gotta be. And I just didn't have the reflexes for it. Oh, I see. I got tricked into that one. And when the ball hits the flipper, it goes dark green or dark. The color goes darker, so that means you can't change it while it's, while it's been hit. Has like a cool down period. Well. There's no way cheating it as well. I tried uh, pushing all the buttons at once. Go okay, every time you see a um, closed uh, flipper, so you don't have to think about it. You push all the buttons at once, but it never works properly. But yeah, you just have to be basically if if you're gonna get a high score on this you either need to um, have good reflexes or um, have a bit of luck because again this is all random so the flippers colors and position open and close are random so if you get a lot, a lot of spaces where you don't need to flip then uh, then um yeah obviously you, you can go to get down faster this is what's my score on here yeah um i'm down here so this is, <laughs> that's probably why i never chose that for the community challenge 
Uh, Dorian, welcome to the stream about your games. Yeah, that's a poor. I do have a poor score on it. I, I, I admit it. I'm not very good on, on that one. Um, right. So the crane splat attack. This is by Reddish Boat and Dorian. I don't know uh, which one did what. I think Reddish Boat made the crayons. Don't hold me to that. Maybe Dorian will. Um, only pick the ones you're good at well well yeah <laughs> no um tumbling dice i chose that one because i don't know i think it's more fun but anyway let's uh let's let's try this all right um number Players one, number human players zero. Even though when I first did that, I thought I had to count myself, so I put one. Three, two. Oh no, one. I didn't put anyone else in. Did I? Okay, wait, how are we there? Wait, there, wait, there, there. Yes, reset progress. Let's play. What do I have to do? Oh, no. oh well, maybe it's other round. But so you want two players? Two players and one human. Three, two, one. All right. So uh, we'll have to begin. Oh, I got the rainbow parts. Then you got power ups as well. Power ups are cool. Oh, I got the rainbow pops. <laughs> oh, I got the rainbow pops. Oh, my tummy hurts. Oh, I got the rainbow pops. So, yep, yeah, it's kind of like, um, oh, my tummy hurts. More twisted version of Splatoon. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's see if I won or not sure if I won or not. Uh, yeah, Registrator already had this as just a drawing game. I made a remix and the, all the logic. And Registrator did the vocal sounds for me. Yeah, I've played the um, the crayon drawing one by Registrator. Who is actually another really, really good creator. You should um, check out. Okay. So that's the, the crayon's splat attack. Um, come over here, Skinny Chad and Dorian. Oh no, not this game. Oh my god, this game is hard. Let's put it that way. So you got like some, you got like a weird rotating shape. I don't know what's happening here like a weird ro rotating shape and you've got to try and navigate across it as it spins it's hard it's damn hard <laughs> okay yeah and i haven't got to the end yet what why did i die why did i die all right Give it one more go. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. But you get the idea. You have to get from one side to the other on that spinny, rotating um, shape. That's by Skinny Chat and Dorian. 
Right then, um, the crayons by reddish bird. So this is, oh, so you, what part did you have? So what part did you have in this? Did, you, what do you say? Uh, the reddish bird or the, uh, the just the drawing game? Okay. So this is Crayons by Reddish Boat and that Dorian. Alright, what's the controls again to change colour? Um, the signs. The signs. <laughs> so yeah, well basically you can just um, possess which colour you want. And then you can do a face like that by just drawing. His lovely face. Yeah, look at that. That is worth a million dollars for him. That's a drawing game. Pretty much similar to the other game we played. Um, 12. I can't play this one either. This one is. I just can't do it. Right, it shows you like all the uh, controls there. Rotate, rotate, da da da. So you have to basically match what's down there. And I can't do it. Well, the one's there. Okay, so we wanna Whoa 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 oh. stop Can't do it Oh do I have to push a button Oh I have to hold it in place don't I? That's right. Line them up. Go back. Okay, I can do it. You get the idea, and you have to try and do the other dice as quick as possible. And you look at the scores on here 34 seconds. I don't know how people have done that. Oh, okay. Everybody's on here. Dorian, Donny, I've I've had a few goes of that and I can't do it. I think it I think it's the sensors in um I think it's the sensors in um my controller they broke. Dorian laugh out like my battery went. Is that where you disappear to? Right then, um And now we go to rolling cubes. This is another one where uh, you kind of have to um, you push up and down, all the cubes roll at the same time, but you have to get the cubes into the right um, places. So obviously, yellow cube will go to yellow square. Um, simple as that. But once it gets into the square, the cube will stay there. And, and uh, yeah, then you have to kind of um just just move all the squares into the right places or the cubes into the right squares so um yeah there's a few rules so i think um dorian said um it's going to um, concentrate more on um, the amount of moves rather than being time based and that the people who um, have got ice scores and have been really creative on, on um, how they achieve the ice scores.
I'm not creative enough to do that. Yay! So yeah, it's level one and the levels go up and maybe get harder. So you still got a timed thing on there, but I think there's is um scoreboard for the amount of moves as well. I think yeah, we go moves. Um yeah, not content of um torturing us with that these little boards and he's gonna made I haven't played the bigger ones yet. But yeah it's the same thing, bigger boards. Which I'm not gonna attempt to do. Oh oops, went out. Didn't mean to go out. Um Games of Things maybe I should have just went to the playlist here. Oh, hang on a minute, Is, am I missing one? I'm definitely that stopper one, where's that stopper one? Oh, there we go, yeah, went past it. My bad. Okay, this is... Um, Dorian, just finished all five levels, the Rolling Cubes Halloween special, making the levels uh, select screen after this. Okay, so, I've seen some of the, you posted some of the um, the boards on the, in the, in the Discord and um yeah so similar instead of square boards you've got halloween themed boards which dorian is going to be releasing soon um looks fantastic looks pretty damn good okay um yeah this one i, I like you could just stop um the square the square within the square quite forgiving as long as like part of the square is in there you can go to next level oh okay but yeah that's that's that let's see let's see my score on this see my scoreboard my friends, Dorian, 27, I'm bossing it. Um, oh, I'm way down the list. I'm above that old zone, so that's, that's, um, thing. oh, Freak City is it's on here as well. That is cool. Right, everyone's played that one. Alright, uh, what have we got left? Oh, the Ghost Train Challenge, which I haven't actually played yet. This is the Ghost Train Score Challenge, which I believe um, Doria made within. Um, Day and a half, I think he said. He tried to get it. Was it in the jam? Decided at the last minute that he wanted to enter the jam, so he had a short time to do it. Um, so yeah, this, this is fairly newish. So let's see uh, what Dorian is capable of doing in a day and a half. Pretty damn lot, by the by the look of it. Right, uh, stuff. I think I was supposed to play this on the stream. I totally forgot about it. I shoot those things. Damn. Like, 
tire, so he's like a power up there. Power up. Okay, it's cool. Get another power up. Power up the cool, oh, the power up. Gordon's probably seen something now about like kind of the piss out of him as uh, he just played through with it. Go <laughs> tell him stuff at his own game. I uh, see the messages coming up, I can't read them at the moment. And wouldn't be surprised if he's seen something like that. Up there, isn't it? What? I'm pretty sure I saw that. What? That was about 43 seconds. Okay, now I'm shooting his power up. Here we go. Got it. I think he's actually out in there. Damn it. His power up is really hard to shoot. Come on. Do it. Do it. Yeah, the power up. Okay, let's um, uh, I want to use shotgun, okay, um, I want to use shotgun, Dorian, um, Javan, it's like until Dorian rush of blood there, yeah. I get these vibes as well, uh, Dorian, yeah, that's what gave me the idea, um, rush of blood. Uh, Java and can't wait for VR support. Yeah, um, th yeah, the rush of blood in VR, it your stomach kind of goes when you're on the roller coaster. As there are also competitions on Dreamerverse forums. That was Ghost Trains. Okay. Cool. Well then, um, so let's get out of here. Let's look at my score. Okay, you got okay. Maybe I, I beat that Harold. Yes, by one. Take that out, Harold. And then, um, yeah, you've got a pretty good score. Maybe I shouldn't take the piss out of you. Right, I take it back. Right. Happy. Oh, right, and to finish things off. How oh, my dear, my dear. Let's give us a thumbs up. To finish things off, this is grid picks. For some reason, I when uh, Dorian first put this up on Twitter, I kept reading Grand Prix for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. But um, yes, this is grid picks, and we just do a um, slideshow. <coughs> manners here we are my manners so yeah as you can see some really big names is Dorian's Dark Harold's some really big names in the in the um, in the list of people that took part of this Yeah, let's shoot Lady Lex UK. Ugh. But yeah, I, this is a very nice idea. Very, 
Very cool. So Dave Dorian's got. I think Dorian's got plans for doing more. All of these, I don't know if they're going to be bigger or whatever, or just kind of the same size. And and um, just doing same size but different people, different pictures. Okay, so this has been um, a show, quick showcase. I say quick showcase. It's been almost an hour. It's been a showcase of uh, all of Dorian's games. Um, yeah, if you let me know if you prefer when I do live streams to do things or edit edited version because if I edited this it'd have been like more like 15 20 minutes um, but yeah this has been a showcase for uh, Dorian's work um, and you can see the progression like we start from his early games to his end games you can see like the progression that he's made as he uh, say went through his journey it's kind of like a journey isn't it uh, Javon was the last pick Aaron Paul I don't know um, done the template for this 16 p uh, people and a 9 person 3 for 3 um, ok yeah so this has been uh, oh, 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 Dorian oh, 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 uh, showcase of his best games and there'll be plenty more to come he's been helping me out with um, with my game as well which is it's still in early development but yeah he's been he's helped me out a lot with um, stuff that I could never have done anyway but um, yeah that's been cool alright so yeah, this has been Dorian's uh, showcase. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed his stuff. Definitely someone to go and follow. Even though he's got two hundred, he's got two hundred fifty-three followers. That says it all. Um, yeah, it's definitely someone to go and follow, and um, someone who's looks like he's always improving uh, with his games. So, this has been his showcase. I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks to anyone turned up to live stream. Thanks for the people who will be watching this in the future, and as always. I'll see you guys again later.